Hello, listen, we went out fishing today. You know, I thought sheep heads were out there running pretty strong today, but no, um, caught some small ones right off the packery. And um, just have one keeper and some whiting and maybe some of the piggies that I caught today. They are a little big. Oh, well, maybe, uh, yeah, it should be all right. Should be all right. Give me, yeah, I'll say 75. 75? Yeah. Right here. Getting ready to go slay some sheep heads. Yes, ma'am. 75 is good. Being that they are so big. All that means I'll cut them in half. <laughs> They're good table shrimp, huh? <laughs> All the posted catch. I did that. Dead shrimp. Let's go. Go see what's out here. I heard the sheep heads are out. That's where we are. We're at the Port Aransas jetties on the very bottom part. Let's see if we can catch some fish today. How deep the water? Probably about 10 feet right there in the side. You gotta... The shrimps are a little bit big, but... Uh... Let's look, we wanna catch fish that are a little bit big too. Yeah. <laughs> Go see. See the dolphin? Going through. Man, if all else fails, bro, we ain't gotta worry about having food. We got plenty of big shrimp in there. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to catch another drum. Well, here you catch uh, almost everything, even kingfish, because uh, you're in an ocean. here about 25 minutes we got a couple of bites and uh, no takers yet I was hoping that the sheep heads were here but uh, we'll see what happened see what we got there's definitely fish in it There you go. Got him off. Well, 
That's the end of the, this fish. We got a new spot. Go out here at a new spot. See what happened. here try out my favorite spot to catch some sheep heads it should be this should be the time for sheep heads you know yep Nice sheepy. Nice. Yeah, that last one was only 12 and a half and uh, we had to uh, throw it back. It has to be 15 inches for sheep heads. That's big enough. Yep. That should be 15. Yep. That was just right here in front. I just threw it right there. Yeah. Sheep heads, yeah. Yep.
got something. I don't know what the hell it is. Yeah, that's a big. That's a big piggies. And uh, we're gonna fry it. Anyway, I guess you can call this catch and cook. But uh, let's get filleting. Let's clean this fish up. I have more more fish to clean, but uh, I just want to show you the sheephead that I caught yesterday. on the sides just like any other fish really go across take it out Look like this is a, a female sheep head. Here she goes. Basically, uh, unless you want the bones, you want to go any farther than that. One nice fillet right there. That's one thing about sheephead, your body is a little wider than most fish. You get more out of it. There you are. One sheep head to lay. 
Yeah, so we're gonna do with this. We're gonna fry it up here shortly. Anyway, we'll see you then. There you go. We got some cornmeal. Kind of a little bit of onion powder, garlic salt mixture in there. We got some white uh, cornmeal and some yellow cornmeal mixed together. And we got some egg wash. And we got the sheep head right here. So let's do it. Well, I like to put it all in there. like to put it back to that pan, the little thing where it came from. Sure, it's got enough uh, coat in it. Let's put this guy's in. I'll say about three or four minutes. Should do it. Yeah, four minutes into it. Look like they're done, but we're gonna give it another minute. There you go. There's your sheep head. Let it cool off, and then we'll give it a shot. Mm. Let's try it out. Moving the tooth. There it is. There you go. Wow. Nice and soft in the inside. This is awesome. Anyway, please like and subscribe to my channel. And, uh, I'm getting close to 1,000, and uh, I'm gonna continue to uh, put a little bit more contents in there. Maybe catch a little more fish, but we're getting there. Thank you. Take care. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.